start. Okay. Okay, so we're making a double shot espresso with an 85 La Favoni and um, a Eureka Specialita from the Mignon line. 55 mil flat birds. And on a machine like this, we are using 14 grams. I'll write all this in the description for anybody who wants to read on the specs. Sometimes with new beans, it's not exactly perfect when it dispenses by time. Um, but you, know, you can just pulse using the manual function. I'm using an AeroPress funnel, because a lot of people ask. It fits really well in this 49 mil portafilter basket. We have espresso ground. We're using a B plus leveler to distribute the ground. Back down to setting one. I don't actually tamp too hard because the coffee is already so fine. So I just use my fingers, polish, extra little tamps because the tamper actually doesn't fit perfectly in the basket. So that's enough. Grinder off, coffee ready. Put that there for a second. Purge any extra pressure that's in the machine. Preheated. And of course, I weigh these shots, so um, zero out the cup. Wait about 15 seconds on the pre infusion, 10 to 15. I'm doing micro fillings to get more water into the group. About three or four till you start to see some of the first drips. I slowly press through till about five seconds where I ramp up the pressure. Usually under a normal amount of weight, you're getting about seven to nine bars. But if you're really pushing, you might get up to 10. It's a little bit too much for this machine, but I find putting a reasonable amount of weight on the lever gives you a good amount of pressure. But halfway through, you want to start to ramp down to about five, and towards the end, you want to let the pressure taper off just below five. Should get 28 grams of coffee for that ratio. Maybe a little more. Uh, it's, <laughs> it's a 34 gram shot, but Despite being a little over the one to two ratio, it is gorgeous. This is a coffee from um, Crafted Lab Roasters in Connecticut. So if you want to look them up on Instagram, I'll put their stuff down below. That's gorgeous. It's so pretty. It smells good. Oh yeah. Sweet, syrupy, smooth. This is a Burundi dry process. Um, really good, really good. Let me go if you wanted to see the name. Raspberry pie, dark fruit, cocoa. Definitely getting that raspberry. It's really, really sweet. There you go. Thanks for watching. Glad to make some coffee on camera again. <laughs> it's been a while.